Yo, 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 it's your boy, the RTJXX. We're here with another episode of CCW Supremacy, where we'll crown a new six way champion in the main event. Uh, the Raven King RTJ and Jeremiah Rose teaming up to take on Mikey Starks and Maverick. Bad guy Jack. Looking for some better luck this week. Going up against Josh Acosta. Without further ado, let's get started. Three match card. And uh, we're going to go wild. So. Mikey and Maverick teaming up. I'm pretty sure for the first time. So, something different here. Where's Jeremiah Rose and uh, the Raven King RTJ? No strangers to each other. Mikey Starks. Mikey Starks will be seeing the Raven King RTJ for the CCW World Championship this Tuesday. Maverick is in the building. The RBU coach and champion. And he's out here wearing blue pop cherry. Maverick looking ready to scrap per usual. This is what this guy does. Uh-oh. Here comes the terrible two. Jeremiah Rose. The last Rose. The murder daddy, as they call him. Jeremiah Rose has been nothing. Nothing but impressive since being around in CCW. Made his debut by attacking his partner today. Challenging for the Limitless title was unsuccessful in that regard. And won the RBU Culture Championship. It was the Raven King RTJ. He's out with tag team championship of some sorts and the CCW World Championship. Showing off his wide variety of championships won all over the world. Jeremiah Rose 
Love being desperados. That's what Mikey Starks is going to deal with on Tuesday. Here we go, Mikey and the Raven King going at each other. Jeremiah Maverick. Mikey's gonna go right after Jeremiah there. Get the page out of. Dax's book, Filthy Season, you heard? Uh-oh. Oh, an interception on the Raven King. My God. Raven King RTJ will be... He will be... In double duty come Tuesday. Teaming up with Kodak. To take on Deuce and Machete of Los Carnales. So it's Carnales versus Terror Blaze on Tuesday. Jeremiah fighting back against Maverick. And Mikey just caught him inside the head. Oh, and Jeremiah Rose is going after Mikey. Super kick. And Maverick's gonna fly. Oh, oh my god, he crashed the burn. Mikey Starks, though, didn't crash the burn. And Mikey Starks with a vicious interception again on the Raven King. Taking him out. Jeremiah Rose. Mikey Starks haven't really met yet. He clears him with an interception, but Jeremiah right back on his feet. Holy shit! And the Raven King went for a ride there like you wouldn't believe. And Mikey again. Ho! Oh! Mikey and Maverick both flying with the greatest of all ease. I don't know, the Terror Blade's not looking, not looking so great right now. Mikey Starks! Mikey Starks, no! Rochambeau! If he hits this, oh, and the Raven King kicks out. But if Mikey hits that move, Mikey is the CCW World Champion, and Mikey, no, was gearing up for another interception, but Raven King blocked that. X Factor! Is that enough? And Maverick is going to try to seal the deal with the wings of Maverick. Oh, and Mikey Starks just pinned him.
Mikey and Maverick get one over on Jeremiah and the Raven King. Next up, bad guy Jack taking on Josh Acosta. Last week it didn't go the way bad, Jack, bad guy Jack wanted to, but uh, he's got a chance to erase that this week. Let's see if he can. Bad guy, Jack. Is ready. And the Burl City Maniacs. On the way to the ring. He's facing Josh. And here we go. Josh Acosta looking for a win. Bad Guy Jack also looking for a win. JC Jane looking to see if this man is man enough to be her client. I mean, last week wasn't a good start. Bad Guy Dome. Oh God, DDT running on the apron. Josh Acosta ate all of that. He ate that apron like you wouldn't believe there, son. Uh-oh. Oh, and Josh. Mm. Make a bad guy. Jack, eat that barricade. Uh-oh, here we go. Backbreaker. Don't call him the wild man for no reason. Six count.
guy. Jack, gonna... No! Crank that back a little bit. Wait a minute. Oh. Bad guy Jack, he uh, kind of missed there. Uh, you know, uh, he missed, but he rebounded nicely. Him and, him and Josh Acosta had the same thing in mind. Great minds think alike. Oh, well, damn. All right. Oh, and Ethan Crane went flying. That bad guy, Jack, just multitasking over here. That was, that's pretty impressive. JC Jane's got to be impressed by that. Oh, double axe handle. Uh oh, bad guy Jack going in for the Koji clutch. Uh, Josh Acosta's going to get out of that, though. Oh, and he went for a lariat. Missed it. By a mile. Bad guy Jack. Ooh. Showing off his, his technical prowess. His athletic ability. Wait a minute. Oh, he almost got caught. He got caught with his can in the cookie jar. JC Jane was going to break something. I knew it. And she was going to break something. No. Oh. Let's be clear. The only reason why Bad Guy Jack didn't win the match last time was because he got caught cheating. He got caught. He got caught being a bad guy. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Bad Guy Jack with the core strength. Mm. That was a uh, extra on that. Oh, sweet chin music. Uh oh, wait a minute. Bad guy Jack with the boom. I think Josh Costa's dead. And bad guy Jack gets the win. JC Jane looks pleased. She looks pleased. The six way championship is on the line. A gauntlet eliminated. Alpha Omega, who, I mean, he got destroyed. So he could use this. The Leo Maverick. Jackson Oak, who came up so close to, to, to winning the CCW World Championship last weekend. But uh, he, didn't, he didn't get the job done, unfortunately. Uh, ATM looking to dance his way and pimp his way to another championship. Prince Dax, who is just, you know, he's already looking to become pure champion. But what if he wins his belt right here? What if he goes after the Battle Dome champion? Or what if he goes after the Raven King or Mikey Starks? That would be interesting, too. And then you got a debuting Daniel Holmes looking to make a big splash right out of the gate. This is anybody's ball game. Let's get to the ring. Six-way championship on the line. Who's walking away with it? If Holmes wins it in his debut. That's crazy.
Alpha Omega looking to possibly redeem himself from that embarrassing defeat at the hands of Chandler Sill, who beat him 2-0 in ultimate fatality. I'm surprised he's even walking right now, to be honest with you. I feel like he's clutching his ribs, and doggone it, he should be. Because Chandler tried to break his back, his spirit, his everything. And there goes M <laughs> ATM, the pimp daddy of CCW. He's ready to get down with the get down and do what he's got to do. Former crown jewel champion. He's looking to become six-way champion. He got himself a world title match. I'll be one step closer to it. For that six-way championship that Landon Acosta just gave up. We're going to have a Titan fight to start this thing off. Alpha Omega. Oh! God, with the grease to ease. Prince Dax, the Owl Prince. Wait a minute. Go! Oh, Alpha Omega. Jesus Christ. Prince Dax is right in there. No! Oh, right to the back. No! Oh, double foot stomp. Jesus Christ. All right. Leo Maverick is bopping his way to the ring. ATM, the two heavyweights going back at it again. Damn. Alpha Omega's back is already hurting. ATM caught Prince Dax. Damn. Body slam, player. Ow. Oh, Alpha Omega with the big boot. Uh-oh, Daniel Holmes making his debut. Drop down, gets the eagle on. Alpha Omega just knocked this Leo Mavericks face off. Oh, there goes Daniel Holmes. Oh, with a neck breaker. Oh, wait a minute. Daniel Holmes, welcome to CCW. And 
Alpha Omega not gonna pin? You're not gonna pin him? Wait a minute. Oh my god. Daniel Holmes is done just like that? Wow. That's crazy. Wow. Jackson Oak is here. And him and the Leo Maverick are going at it. Prince Dax just got busted wide open. No! Oh, and Jackson Oak. Chair shot. Right to the face. I'm still. Daniel Holmes. I, oh my god. I'm still shocked at that. It's not a. That's not as romantic as a debut as you want it to be. Prince Dax and Jackson Oak going at it. Jackson Oaks music still playing in the background. No! With a DDT. Jackson Oak. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Alpha Omega got caught. Holy shit. He popped him right in the jaw. Jackson Oak might be finished. Wow. Prince Dash is busting wide open. Wait a minute, Leo Maverick. Uh oh. Damn. And Prince Dash, AR 15. Leo Maverick is done. Alpha Omega. Dax kicks out. The ATM. Oh boy. Ah, oh, shoot. <laughs> Dax said, don't touch me. No, the big neck breaker. My ATM. Uh oh. GP7. Everybody's getting dropped while Jackson Oaks music is still playing in the background. 
I guess he really is the composer. Oh, ATM. Chair shot to the head and Prince Dax. That might be it. Dax is bleeding a gusher. Uh oh. ATM is bleeding like a mofo, too. ATM is finished. Prince Dax and Alpha Omega. There's so much blood on the floor right now, it's ridiculous. ATM, my God. Alpha Omega. Oh my God. Look at that. Prince Dax with a suplex. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, Rocky Mountain Crunch. Little Dexito bang. Big time backbreaker. It's with the world. That might be it. No, and it's not. Little Dexito Bang still hanging in there. Off Omega, gut wrenches. Oh, and Prince Dax. Rabbit chair shot to the face. Prince Dax might be a sitting duck right now. Oh my God, and he is. Alpha Omega. Oh, just. Ooh. I think that's done. I, I. And Alpha Omega is the new six-way champion. Which means he's two defenses away from becoming number one contender to a Battle Dome or CCW World Championship. He took an L and bounced back. I give him all the credit in the world. But hey, that's it for us until Tuesday. This is your boy, the RTJXX. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. Catch you guys later. Peace out.